Hey, do you know how join method works in JS? Let's see what the explanation tell us. It says that it creates and returns a new string. That is by concatenating all of the elements in this array. Did you get it right? Now let's move to see it implementation done using our JS code. Here, look at our names array. We are going to apply join method upon it and see what different types of output we get. First, let's see what if we apply it using no separator. We have to call the names array and use dot join to get the result of it. As you can see, we haven't passed any separator in it, but in output, it takes comma as its default separator and returns new join string that is comma separated. Now, look at this another example where we have used a separator. We are providing a hyphen as our separator. So in our output, we get hyphen separated string. As you can clearly see, the output we got was hyphen separated string joined together. Now, what if we provide an empty string as our separator and see what output we get? Let's see the output in our console. Okay, we get a bunch of string joined without any space. Cool, we learned something new today. Like and share for more.